Let's see if they can see chat like normal. Looks good. And we're ready to go. 2v2 action here tonight. Bearded Bot staring it down. That one's in. Ultimate Coder. Got a little over, over eager. Puts it in. And a demo, why not? It's the worst part of the game. And here's Presla. Can he slide it over Presla? With a fantastic wall read. And they tie it up. Can't be pressed. So 10 seconds in, we have a goal apiece for each team. Oh, I, I feel I feel better. I think I sound a little better, but I definitely feel a lot better. That's your yeehaw. Gets a save. Here's Presla. Already has a goal to his name. Back to his captain, the ultimate co coder. Gets it past Bearded Bot. Let's see if I remember it. Supersonic acrobatic rocket propelled volleyballers <laughs> are up by one. And let's let's see how high score in this game one gets. Drops it down to the turf. Yeehaw! Puts it out to the midfield. Presla catches. Coder. Put it out. And to the Coder. Ultimate Coder. Driving the uh, the Nomad. Or the, uh, the Tomad. As we uh, sometimes call it on this channel. <laughs> Presla. Out of the corner. He's going to lose possession. Bearded Bot. Gets the cross. Yeehaw! Can't touch Coder. Driving the rest of the way. Rolls up the wall to the left of the goal. Fifty there down to the turf. Presla. Goes flying. Bearded bot. Ricochets it off the wall towards the net. Yeehaw! Can't hit it! Had everything lined up for him and just goes flying on the shot attempt. Coder gets up, keeps it going. Off the post! And Yeehaw gets it away from Presla. Presla. Look at the score on the rebound. Maybe the tie. Yeehaw! Can't get to it. Ultimate Coder driving down the sideline. Over the wall, the backflip. And out to the corner, neutralized play. Icarus says, Tomad, ew. You wanted a, a nice, what'd you say, comfort for your drive home. <laughs> you, you get back to your dog and you hug her and you cuddle her. You tell her how much you, you love her and miss her. Bearded Bot runs it up the wall. Yeah, but that backflip though. The tying score, not quite. Coder driving down the field, gets it going, the breakaway. Coder off the backboard. <laughs> And didn't need too much for the rest. That's what we see from a 2v2 matchup. Lots of open space. Easy to catch yourself out of position. And Supersonic up by two now. Two minutes to go in game one. Presla up the wall. Zero boost. Try to get one more touch. No good. Coder 
Drives for the center, goes high and way over the net. Ziha puts the dingo into the ball for a wide right shot. Iha to the corner. Bearded bot. No one really wants possession. Coder finally sends it away. Something meaningful. Presla gonna take time. Iha up and over. Can read it off the wall. Coder too quick. Playing it safe. It looks like they're comfortable with this 3 1 lead. Brutality. They just have to hang on. For about 40 seconds. Crossing. Crossing. High. Can't get it done there. Now half a minute. Three to one. Supersonic. Looking to end this right. But Oklahoma driving down the field. Yeehaw pops up to himself and doubles. Trying to facilitate the comeback. 18 seconds to go. And this next kickoff means a lot for both teams. And Bearded Bot gets it to the back blue corner. Koda touches. Yeehaw, looking down, but it looks like Presla with a fourth goal for supersonic acrobatic rocket propelled volleyballers <laughs> down the field. Presla making it look easy. Six seconds to go, and that should be it. We had some some late drama in game one. Coder gets knocked away and down to the turf. Game one wasn't quite ready to shut down. And I realized I, I just awarded the wrong team here in the scoreboard lights. Let's try this ultimate coder captain. For the squad, MVP, two goals, one assist, one save, five shots, two saves for Presla. Nice team effort for them. And then, <laughs> God, you guys remember, right? I wasn't I wasn't there by myself. When it came time for April Fools. Psionics just just broke the game. They piped in. They got rid of the crowd noise. They put the the Rocket League super fan in, and the game just just broke. But when we want it to operate like normal, it's just not gonna happen for us. <laughs> Bar down. But not in. And we stay 0-0, zero, zero, so my boost overlays won't be working until I reset Rocket League. I should be able to do that. Before the the invitational matchup, Coder tries to drive it in. Bearded Bot, away he goes. Gets behind the defense, makes a save, makes a move. And makes it work for him in space. Oklahoma takes the lead.
to the field. Pressler sends it to the corner. Coder. A decent set there. Pressler unable to get to it. It is a dress bearded bot. Drives in. Tries to muscle it the rest of the way. Can't get it done. Ziha drops it down to the turf. Iha, keeping it speedy, staying aggressive, and it's Oklahoma up by two. Big dunk there from Iha. Pressler gets caught up in the inside of the net. And that is a recipe for a second Oklahoma goal. Looking for man number three now. Pressler sends it down the field. No one can get back to it. They get out of position again. Oklahoma gets killed. I'm not 100% sure how it happened. Looks like Bearded Bot just took a little too much time in the corner. Went for boost. And Supersonic gets their first goal relatively easily. Here's Yeeha. It's a wall pinch at the midfield. Coder. Driving in. Pressla has plenty of boosts. Look a little awkward on the touch out. And Coder gets 100 boost. Off the wall. Staying with it. Good 50 for him. Bearded Bot can't get to it. Pressla with the center. Coder with the dunk. Not too dangerous. It is in the orange corner, but nothing too threatening so far. Ziha beats the defender. Looking for a second. Gets a bump. Harassing the defender. It's Coder. And Coder is looking to go to work on the left sideline. And Presla flies through the air to make the stop. Flying almost a third goal. Bearded Bot gets the shot. But has to watch it. Get saved to the corner. And it's a rule one. I didn't see it till late, but a rule one in the blue net. <clears throat> Going toe to toe. No pun intended in Oklahoma up by two. They, they should be able to do enough here to get the win. Two minutes remaining and some defense, some strong, smart defense, smart play will get them out of game two with a win. Coder sends it away, drops it down to the turf. Presla. Sends a one-hopper. Yeehaw! Launches it down the field. Coder on a great rotation. Gets the save. Now a touch. Pops up a little too high. Should have left his wheels. And the save! What a play. Off the post! And another play on the other side. And a demo, why not? Get him a body bag! Yeah! Pressler up to the ceiling. Coder can't get to it. It, it does look like Oklahoma is going to get their first win of the of the series. What you doing, Tanner? If they hang on, Presla says not so fast. We're not going away. 41 seconds left. And he sends a dunking bullet to the orange net. A one goal difference between these two teams. Oklahoma needs to hang on here. Now down to half a minute. Coder. Coder gets it in. 
amazing solo play shrugs off a defender Thirty-two seconds remaining. So you're telling me there's a chance. General says Oklahoma's been around for a while. Uh, I remember casting them a lot last circuit, but I don't think I remember them too much before. Yeah, yeah. I, I only started talking to their captain February of this year. Presley looking for the read. What a save! Ten seconds. We looks like we're. All poised for overtime. Unless we have some last second heroics. Yeehaw lined up for the shot. Coder smothers their hopes. Fight! And it's in! Bearded Bot! Two seconds into overtime. <laughs> Ultimate Coder misses with the nomad do do people like that car or do, are they using it ironically and there you see the the broken lobby it's not gonna show us orange team Why do, why do we play Rocket League? We thought about that. And here it is, game number three. Oklahoma battles back. Going a little late. I think it's a console thing. Bressler to the sidewall. Can't touch it. Here comes Yeehaw. Tries to get past midfield, but he runs into the coder. The code man. Touches then, crosses the orange net, bearded bot. Speedy with boost beats a defender on the sidewall. Yeehaw drives the rest of the way. And Oklahoma sends it back to their side of the field. I don't think this is what they wanted. Pressla gets up near miss on the dunk. And a 50 up the wall into the field. Coder and Yeehaw get tied up at the midfield. Nice shot, little wide, Yeehaw. And Coder still battling. Still at, at the 50. And a save there from Yeehaw keeps it to a wide shot. As Ultimate Coder has these moments where he, he gets up and just launches the ball towards the net. A little more accuracy and he'd be he'd be that much dangerous that much more dangerous rather yeah but that backflip though as bearded bot with a tactical backflip yeehaw looking to clear the way but presla gets a fantastic dunk bearded bot not letting it get past the front post presla still battling through good pressure from Supersonic acrobatic rocket propelled volleyballers. They realize that if if they give Oklahoma an inch, they'll take a mile. I'm gonna come at you like a spider. Presla lines it up 50, can't get to it. Tried to drive it in. I think he would have been better off with a, a high shot. Defender. Able to line in there. Is he? Is it more a potato or a toe? <laughs> I I tried to call it a toe mad, but Icarus said ew. So may, maybe that's maybe that's not the vibes. Bresla 
down the sideline. Yeehaw, just around, hanging around. Doesn't want to overtouch, doesn't want to put his teammate in a dire situation. And Yeehaw gets a save. 0-0 zero, zero, down the field at the two-minute mark. Oklahoma threatening an ultimate coder. That's that's what we've been talking about. He just has this this breakneck air about him. He'll just be driving, put put putting along, and then in almost an instant, he'll hit a shot. Speaking of hitting a shot, bearded by gets back to midfield. And Oklahoma again find themselves in the lead. They're going to tell us that game two wasn't a fluke. They're here to stay. They're here to win the series. Yeehaw has some room to work with. Trying to win on the breakaway. Bearded Bot floats it. Pressless there. Can't get to it. Yeehaw got stopped. Can I get a. Oh, yeah. And Pressla. Looked like he couldn't believe his eyes. Back for the save, unable to, to get his mitts on it. And here's Coder. Driving in, trying to get a fake. Back in, good pass, but Pressla a little too far back and that could be a symptom from their not only their game two loss, but them being down too late in this one. You just start second guessing yourself. You start pulling back. Taking yourself out of position. Bearded bot. Touching. Look at the dribble. This is trouble here. Supersonic needs another one. Coder looking for it. Gets it. Gets it done. Potato, tomato. <laughs> Not a great visual. You have to imagine a really. I'll, I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna stop what I was saying there. So you're telling me there's a chance. So under 30 seconds, Oklahoma can't seem to really close out the game when they have the lead. They allowed a late overtime in game two. 10 seconds to go here. Defense! 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 And what is going on here? Bearded Bot, just like they drew it up. Coder says his axles are broken. Nice shot. I, I'm having a hard time believing it, so I can only imagine Supersonic is doing the same, and Yeehaw is there! Oklahoma coming to this series one and two, but Yeehaw! Yeehaw and his captain, Bearded Bot, they're coming for another win. Izzy says it's only game three. It is indeed. <laughs> it is indeed. I, I knew when you came in talking about the potato. That you, you weren't in your right state of mind. Oklahoma now lead the series. And maybe just needed to, to warm up. After game one. Game one still, still close in its own right. But now Oklahoma finds themselves in match point. Chance to win it here. They, they broke it, Izzy. I know you'll complain about psionics with me. <laughs> they broke it. Yeah. 
Touches back. Ceiling down. A wide shot. And a demo. Why would you kill him like that? Get him a body bag. Yeah. So 0-0, zero, zero, Arklahoma. Says, bro, why does Pressla have that decal on? I haven't even noticed. I, what is it, stars? Or did he switch it? Yeehaw. Up the back wall. Hold on. Coder trying to force a game five. Ojo, Cristiano, Cristiano del área. Sigue Cristiano. And this, this has that, that familiar feeling of going the distance, going to a game five. For those of you just joined us, supersonic, acrobatic, rocket propelled volleyballers. They, they came out in game one and, and had a statement to make. But ever since then, they've been having trouble finishing things out, Oklahoma. And Yeehaw's gonna airmail this one. Ooh, he's trying. And that's good enough for the tie back to scale on the scoreboard. Another kickoff. Back to Coder. Not ready for it. Yeah, what, what's wrong with this decal here, Izzy? I don't mind it. Yeehaw with a big dunk back to the corner. Pressla has to make this touch and does so. Coder sends it away. What a shot from Coder to regain the lead. That's what you call pulling it back and letting it go, PJ. A tough save to make. Coder putting it where you can't get it. And we may be back to another seesaw here. Pressla off the wall into the field. Bearded bot up the ceiling. Coder down the sideline. Looking to read it. 50s through. Pressla. He has the muscle. Gets the pass. Ultimate Coder finishes. Can I get a. Oh, yeah. And this is the kind of urgency you'd expect to see from Supersonic. Now leading by two. I, I don't believe they've lost the lead in this series. And they damn sure haven't lost the lead by three. So this again has the makings of a game five. We're going to go the full series here. Unless Oklahoma can rattle off four unanswered goals in these next two minutes and change. Here's some offense. Bearded Bot, Yeehaw can't get to it in the demo. You're not that guy, pal. Bearded Bot up, flies from the corner. Coder now is down the sideline. Sends one. Pressla stopped in his tracks. Yeehaw, trying to negotiate it. Simple air carry. Can't get it to go. Credited with the shot. Pressla puts it on target. Yeehaw, gets in the way. Coder. Oh my god, it's not even keeping track of the stats. <laughs> oh, I hate this. Here's 
Chris Pressler. Looking around. He's got that look in his eye. Ross is in and Pressler, the look in his eye, turned it in, turned into goal five. Gets the pass from Coder. Splits the post five to one. Another statement game. Oh, what a great potato. Uh, I had that decal on my scuffed 1v1 car. <laughs> oh, from BTTV. Okay, let's go potato. And this is going to be a forgettable game for Oklahoma. It was Supersonic that found themselves large and in charge and winning by four. Yeehaw. Gets up. Bearded bot. Tries for a self pass. So they were only able to score one. So they're going to have to recapture the magic they had in the two games prior. Let's see if they can do any of that in the last 10 seconds here. Hard to choose who to bet on. <laughs> I, I, I'm glad that became a channel. Uh, A channel tradition. I feel bad that I don't I don't run them the predictions all the time, but you know how it be. All right, here we are. Oh. Start the prediction there. You're going to have a little bit to do it. General says you should feel bad. Ouch. Ouch. So before I forget the light here, we are tied on the series. 2-2. Two, two, game 5 action. We're going to go with the full intermission. Yeehaw. Taking his time. We have the messed up lobby courtesy of the Rocket League update. Courtesy of Psionics just refusing to pay a person to get it right the first time. But again, like April Fools, no problem. No issues there on on April Fools Day. Just a slam dunk, easy. Easy money for them. Izzy with the sub. Oh, that prime sub. Who usually gets your prime sub, Izzy? I know you I know you give that away when you're drunk sometimes. <laughs> so here we are running predictions coder. Can't get to it. There's the demo. I like the way you die, boy. Bressler on the corner. No good for him. Oklahoma on their heels. Rolls it away. Yeehaw. Drops it down to the turf. Up the corner, Pressless swinging around. And the 50. Shot and save. Yeehaw on defense. Yeehaw. Has to get back on D here. Plenty of boost. We know he's very comfortable off the wall into his aerials. But Coder might score on this. Going for the wall read. Can't get it done. Press little the backboard. Around and around. Yeehaw catches. Floats it away. I thought he had the read, but we stay scoreless. Yeah. 
Hit it, but cross it in, no shot, no save, and Presla has possession. Up the wall, 50. Coder, turn it around. Yeehaw, sends it away. So it's only appropriate that game five be the closest shot and save. They are dueling. Coder drives it in. Supersonic gets the lead. And I thought it might be trouble. I thought it might be trouble when Oklahoma had the double commit on the shot. It, it's hard to fault them on it. They, they went up. It was a good looking center. But both of them went up to address it. And credit to Ultimate Coder. He knew exactly what to do from there into the field and the demo it's the worst game. and we are back to scale but uh yes cosmic it's d2 d3 for uh tier four of uh of igl and we are tied yet again halfway through game number five you knew this would end with drama Shot goes high. Yeehaw goes wide. Back in. Bearded Bond. No. Off the post. Can't finish it up. Yeehaw. Getting back to it. Pressler with the dunk. Not ready to follow it up. Bearded Bot. Side swipes the touch. Oklahoma back with possession and another demo. Get him a body bag. Yeah. Coder. Trouble. He gets bumped off the ball. I don't even know if Bearded Bot wants possession. He just wants Coder away from it. And Bearded Bot makes it look easy. Bullies him. Bumps him. Oh, yeah. Banana bread, bro. Oklahoma with their first lead since game number three. Coder. Up the side wall. Good center. Up the field. Yeehaw. Gets spun out. Coder. To the back blue corner. And back into the field. And a big 50 to the other side. Of the pitch. Bearded bot. Big dunk. Big 50. 100 boosts to his name. And Presla. Flies up for defense. With all the urgency in the world. Coder bumps off his teammate. That may be the go-ahead goal. Pressla gets the save. Outstanding. Bearded Bot dunks it in. Oklahoma. Defense not good enough for them. Yeah. 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 Uh, I, I've talked to Yeehaw before. Or I've, I've at least talked to Bearded Bot about it, and uh, he he definitely lost his mind <laughs> when they when they had that goal explosion. Another demo, and that might be the back-breaking play. They figured something out. Would you look at that? Filthy. Absolutely filthy. And they're putting it up, putting it down. And Cosmic was probably talking about a few plays ago. He says, what was the plan? I, I think it was on the that bump play where Coder, uh, Coder bumped his teammate. I, I think they just got a little antsy. Maybe Presla was, was calling him into the play in the VC, but General says new emotes. Of course, new emotes. Keeping it fresh, keeping it fresh and funky. Uh, but th those are just the free ones that that you that anyone can add into the field and out of the corner. And a three-goal differential for Oklahoma. Game five. 
Congrats to them. I'll get to 15k channel points eventually. Can everyone please give Fury some shit for saying an 8 p.m. cast is too late? <laughs> you know what's crazy? Is that you and... Oh, look at this lobby. <laughs> uh, you, you and Boosak Jr. needed that 8 p.m. slot. What do you guys want me to do? What do you guys want me to do? I live a life. I live a life. I work full time. <laughs> you guys want me to be everywhere at once. All right, let me first things first. Let me reset my Rocket League. Lame as fuck. <laughs> Your camera's hella laggy? Is it really? Let me call bot. No, that's just how he is. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm lagging in real in real life. All right, calling out to to bearded bot. What a a win for them. Bot. Not sure. Okay, there he is. Hey. All right, can you hear me all right? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Congrats. Huge win for you guys. Uh, no panic in you. I was a little worried for you after game one, but uh, talk, talk me through the series a little bit. Yeah, we uh, we came in trying to warm up, and then we realized right. we both had an update. <laughs> and so we got a couple warm-up games in. We got two. Uh, okay, and, okay. Uh, I don't know, just weren't real comfortable. And then they they weren't giving. Yeehaw usually is crazy off the wall and everything. Right. And they, they did a really good job not giving him space. Right. Which is which is interesting in game one, because that, that's just how fast they were moving. Usually, you know, you're in a IGL match, best of five, and you see it, one player just start popping off in one of the early games. And then yeah. you just kind of tell yourself, like, okay, don't give that person, don't give that player space. Just jump on them when they get it. But I, I guess they, they, had them, they had them pinned in game one. And just just like you're saying, once once he did get that space, once you guys responded in in the series and even took the lead, I think you got them second guessing. I think you made them slow down a little bit, and I I think we saw you guys uh, uh, just on on full display. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, um, we is a, we're a three man team, and uh, Yeehaw doesn't usually play, but he subbed in for game five. He subbed in for me a few times, and. Uh, He's kind of like our ace up our sleeve type of thing. He, okay. he decided he didn't want to play IGL, and then we kind of talked him into it right <laughs> as the season was starting. <laughs> and so now he's what? now he's getting back in it. What what were those conversations like? Man, we just I keep I keep on him, kept inviting him, and <laughs> our other our other guy is uh, he works nights, so it's just we're trying to schedule his with his work schedule. It's it's hard sometimes. So I just, I was like, man, I need you just to be, be there. If he can't be there or if he, right, you know, right. he didn't get enough sleep one night or whatever. And I think that's what happened today. Cause he, he messaged us asking if we played in 30 minutes and he just, I don't know if he wasn't feeling good. Yeah. Yeah. Enough sleep throughout the day or what. So he was like, man, I'll play. It's fine. <laughs> well, good, good for Yeehaw. What, why did he want to stop playing IGL? I, we just, we were playing other games. We weren't practicing enough, and it was just uh, kind of frustrating that we were, right. as a team, practicing enough. And now we're starting to get back into it a little bit more. So he's he's wanting to come back. Okay, all right, that's good. That yeah, that's it's completely understandable. Uh, as fun as IGL is, it it you know every loss kind of it, it wears on different people differently. <laughs> yeah, know, I don't I don't Especially playoffs. Right, right. Yeah, I don't I don't take a too well and and a lot of people really need that off season to kind of recenter themselves before they they sign up again um but, yeah so so sure. yeah i it's it's very understandable that that you know if if you're gonna invest the time you know i guess yeehaw would want you know that full commitment from you know not only everyone but maybe himself 
just with the, yeah. the practicing the playing that way we you know when you do when you do take the field you know you're you're having fun you're winning you're competitive uh so yeah this this puts you up to to two and two so yeah. so con- congrats that you know with yeehaw back in focused you know maybe you yeah. guys have a, a late run in store yeah i hope so but yeah look good look look uh it was good to see you guys again are you still running the threes team as well or yeah. is it just two yeah we have yeah we have a threes team um we have four of us on there um we have i i made us go up before you we added you haul and twos to a new tier so we moved up a tier in twos and then uh, the guy that we play with all the time he's uh he had champ rewards in twos a couple years ago so he's never really stayed in champ but for threes i guess with the champ rewards and and twos it kind of bumped us up another oof. tier in threes so so we have a guy that's a tier three just because of his rewards <laughs> that's 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 rough it's it, yeah that's rough but yeah. uh but congrats again any uh any closing words from you any shout outs or anything before we take off here no just thank you for thank you for doing it i enjoy your streams thank you uh yeah yeah for sure i, I put up i try to sunday night i try to have the the schedule up you know i know a lot of the the captains that are that are eager to to plan lock everything down and then book a a a caster probably look at the beginning of the week so i try to have it pretty much set so yeah i was was glad to to get you guys again but uh but congrats once more and, and good luck next week all right thanks yeah peace bye All right. So I reset the game. Top of the hour, we have...